crop circles. Are these colossal, complicated patterns left behind by extraterrestrials? Or are those mysterious mowed fields just a man-made alien hoax? It's a question asked by anyone who's ever seen those strange, otherworldly circles and wondered, where do crop circles come from? Let's find out in today's episode of... Colossal Mysteries. As you probably know, crop circles are giant, strange shapes, mainly made up of circles, that are mysteriously cut into fields of crops all across the globe sometimes seemingly overnight. The shapes stamped into the field by crop circles are usually so precise that they look as though they were made by a machine, or at least someone who can see them from above. Many of us assume that crop circles have been around for a long time, yet most experts agree they didn't appear until the 1970s. Of course, there are those who dispute that. Crop circle conspiracy devotees point to several anecdotal accounts from the past as possible examples of historical crop circles. For example, in 1678, an English pamphlet was published entitled The Mowing Devil, or Strange News Out of Hertfordshire. It tells the story of a farmer who refused to pay a worker to mow his field, telling him he'd rather have the devil mow it than pay the man. According to the pamphlet, that night the farmer's field was set aflame, but the next morning it was mysteriously found to be perfectly mowed in a way no man could accomplish. The story, along with the picture in the pamphlet, has led some conspiracy theorists to point to it as the first recorded example of a crop circle from 300 years ago. The next curious case in crop circle history took place in Tully, Queensland, Australia back in 1966. According to reports, a local farmer saw a large flying saucer rise 30 feet in the air out of a swamp and fly away. A bit curious, the farmer investigated the spot where the saucer had been and reportedly found a circle of flattened grass and reeds. Some conspiracy theorists believe that this points to aliens as a likely culprit for creating crop circles. But an investigation by police, a local university, and the Australian Air Force concluded that the incident likely had some kind of natural cause, like a whirlwind or water spout. The first real examples of full-on crop circles started popping up across the quaint English countryside in the 1970s. And from the start, they puzzled the locals. Newspapers all around England were covering the strange story. And before long, an international crop circle sensation was born. Throughout the 80s and 90s, as media coverage of crop circles grew, both the number of crop circles and their complexity skyrocketed. Some of the most elaborate even illustrated strange and complex mathematical equations. Okay, so crop circles might not be as old as we like to think, but it still doesn't answer the question, where are they coming from? Are crop circles some kind of paranormal event or just an elaborate prank? There are those who believe that extraterrestrials are responsible for creating crop circles. Perhaps they're imprints left behind by UFOs or alien symbols marking different areas around Earth. Other, more scientifically minded people explain them away as the result of powerful wind patterns, energy fields, or more often than not, outright hoaxes. In fact, it was proven in the early 1990s that most, if not all, crop circles were man-made pranks. You see, in September of 1991, two British rabble-rousers named Doug Bauer and Dave Chorley admitted that they were behind many of England's most famous crop circles and had personally created hundreds of them since the late 70s. Ever since Bauer and Chorley admitted to their hopes, just about every known crop circle has been chalked up to copycat pranksters trying to cause a stir. And yet, even still, there are those who believe that humans could never carve out one giant elaborate crop circle that fast without someone noticing them making it. And for those who believe, that means that a mysterious something, or someone, must be making it. We'll let you decide for yourself. And now you know a little bit more about the strange history of crop circles. Comment below with a mystery you'd like us to solve. And remember to subscribe for more episodes of Colossal Mysteries. Only on DreamWorks TV.